Hey everybody, how are y'all doing today? Um, today I'm going to show y'all something that we product we came across last year when we were on the beach. Um, it's called Sun Ninja. Um, we normally bring like the little pop-ups you can like buy at like Walmart or, or Home Depot or Lowe's or those kind of places. Um, they tend to me to be easier to break essentially um, because the way they're made. Um, people even use them for like say um, game day stuff at Alabama and stuff like that when they're tailgating. Um, this product right here essentially accomplishes the same thing except um, I'll show you later on the video kind of how it works. Um, it doesn't, it's even in high winds, like say on the beach where it's windy, it doesn't break. Now, we've had times where maybe we left it up for a few hours to go to lunch and it fell over, but it wasn't a big deal. Like nothing gets broken. It takes like really, literally 30 seconds to set it back up. And it gives you very good uh, uh, canopy for the sun. Um, the kids love it. We love it. Um, but I'll, I'll get to it um, the rest of this video and show you how to set it up, how it works. Um, Honestly, I'll show you my preferred way of setting it up um, because I have kind of the way I like setting it up as opposed to what I've ever seen for even from the manufacturer or other videos. But um, let's get to it um, and I'll show you. Just keep watching on this video. Um, I'll have a link below where you can purchase one of these from Amazon. Um, if you do click and purchase one, um, I, am as, I am an Amazon affiliate um, with a lot of different items. Um, this does support my channel if you actually did buy one even even going to check it out and clicking on it supports my channel so um, I'm about to get to it and I'll show you how it works um, thank y'all very much okay the first thing you need to do is just find you a really doesn't even have to necessarily be a totally flat spot but just a, a flat beachy area where you want to set up um, the main thing in this is you need sand um, so you'll find that area and what I do is I lay the whole thing out it's essentially just like a big thing that you're gonna stretch out and each arm and there's four arms on it and you're gonna fill each one of those with sand so what I do especially when it's very windy on the beach like it gets usually um, I essentially set it up and I put sand a bunch of sand in one of the arms and you'll see in the pictures um, and then I just essentially go around the whole thing and put sand in um, from there you want to kind of stretch everything out good and tight um, and because if you don't get everything tight enough it, it has a tendency to want to fall over because the whole the tent once you get uh, enough sand in each and uh, each end of the arm and get it tight the whole thing will stay up once you get the poles in so once you got everything all stretched out so what you're gonna do is under the front left and front right um, if you look at the demos and stuff they have online, people do it different where you put a pole under each arm. Um, you can do this. Um, you can also put one pole under the front. Um, the main thing you want to do is, with the wind coming towards you, you want to make sure you face your Sun Ninja into the wind. So you kind of want it like a kite going into the wind where it puffs up. You want to do that, and that's kind of how, like, like mine is not exactly uh, parallel with the, the ocean. It's because I kind of angled a little bit to catch the wind, and that's the best case scenario because the whole thing will puff up, and as long as you got it all stretched out good, you'll get good tension. So, what I did with mine is, is I put, I made the front left and front right poles. I used two on each side to give it more stability because it was kind of windy that day, um, and I just them and essentially just stick them up into the fabric um, and across you can kind of see in my pictures kind of how I have it done and then on the top of it there's these little scrunchy things and you want to scrunch them around and this keeps the the poles from sliding around on the top because um, if you don't have these I've seen I know somebody on the beach that same day forgot their little the little scrunchy things and theirs kept falling over a lot ours stayed up for hours um, and even if it does fall over the things it doesn't break anything you just put the poles back up and, and keep going and that's why i love this thing because it's extremely light easy to carry on the beach and even in good winds it still performs very very well um, and gives you good sun protection um okay okay from this point you just sit down in your chair spread out your Blank it out in front and you enjoy. Um, if y'all have any questions, you feel free to leave them down below. Um, also, like I said in the beginning, if 
Um, if y'all like this kind of content or for me to keep sharing this kind of stuff, um, feel free to like the channel or subscribe. And um, I have a wide range of things that I'm probably just going to make videos on. Um, also, I'll have links to the Sun Ninja in, in down below for Amazon. Um, I do have an affiliate, so if you do click on and or buy, um, it does support the channel in that way. Um, thank you very much, and y'all have a good day.